It's been one year since many Indiana businesses allowed customers to light up thanks to the statewide smoking ban. Some business owners and managers were concerned they'd see a decline in sales. But as News Channel 15's Megan Royce uncovered, it's been exactly the opposite for one local restaurant. Megan? Mark and Heather, about a year ago, I talked with folks at Richard's Restaurant in Columbia City. Then, smokers made up about 15% of their sales. Now, a year later, business is better than ever since they kicked the habit. Back then, smokers weren't happy they'd have to butt out. A bunch of baloney. And Richard's restaurant manager, Karen Schnorr, was nervous they'd bring in less money. I think it'll hurt at first, but I think in the long run that sales will go up. Her hope held true. Almost immediately after the smoke cleared, sales started rising. Business has been up, and I've seen customers we did not see for three to five years that will come in now. And they're in here come sometimes two and three times a week. Schnorr's regulars who are smokers still pop in every now and then. Some of them will come in and go outside and have their cigarette and they still come in and have lunch. Maybe not as often as they were, but they still are here a couple times a week. Since the ban, they've put a fresh coat of paint on the walls and replaced all the ceiling tiles. It is nice to have a new clean restaurant that doesn't stink and you don't go home as non-smokers smelling like smoke. Schnorr says the smoking ban's a win-win for Richards. Better sales and overall happier customers. I'm sure there's a little bit of mixed emotions with some of the smokers, but I have more people that are appreciative of it not being smoked. A spokesperson for the State Department of Health says about 97 percent of businesses and major venues in the state are following the rules and complying with the smoking ban. In Studio 15 tonight, Megan Royce, News Channel 15.